<laughs> this is Spotlight TV, and I am Christian Listap. You say for the people at home, who are we here today with? The Enigma and G Rigger. So what's going on here? Uh, we're actually in the process of filming a movie right now for Killer Wolf Films. It's called Warriors of the Apocalypse. Well, Tractor, how about you? What, what are you doing in the film? Sweating. A lot. Really? Yes. Like, who do you play in the movie? I play with myself. <laughs> Some others, if they let me. I am a mercenary, so you will do as I say, or I'll still take it. You're mad. Blow your brains out. <laughs> so, how, <laughs> how many manhoods have you taken? Just yours. <laughs> um, that would be Christian, I took your manhood. What do you both do in it? Well, we were involved in some fight scenes the other day. For now, we're just being extras, you know, being zombie sort of things and stuff like that. So. Well, what are you doing, G Raver? <laughs> what was your fights? Uh, I had a couple fight scenes. This is a Go, Bo Ener <laughs> <laughs> Go Energy drink um, <laughs> that you can get from uh, Circle K, I guess that's what it's called. That's pretty good, too. No, don't do that. <laughs> oh, <Jesus Christ>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> the tractor, oh my god. Hello? I think this interview is over. <laughs> yeah, I think this interview is What the fuck? I, I hope he's not pissed no. at that. Turn down Manchester. You're safe. Oh, so anyway, what's, so what's, your, what's your, what's your fight like? Uh, <laughs> Well, got my ass kicked by a girl, so that's always interesting. Oh, it was pretty fun. It was a good time. Really enjoying it. Having a great time. Do a 360 on the camera right now. A 360? Yeah. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> Just pan around. Man. Do it. Spotlight no, TV. No, come on. <laughs> no. Spotlight TV, that is a no dick. Freeze frame. That's, a, that's an MMA dick. Check out my dollar sign. I, can't, I don't want to zoom that close to it. Is there but you can't look away? Because someone like, like zoom up close. Like, there you go. Is there a piercing there? Yes. <laughs> that's a song. I didn't want to look at it. I wonder if that's going to wind up on the DVD. <laughs> on Spotlight not. TV, but on the DVD. <laughs> <laughs> Have we not come to expect that this is what's going to happen sometimes? Christian, is that be sir? <laughs> so you're drinking the Go Grape Energy Drink. Yeah. Only 59 cents. <laughs> I know. I, Plus I, tax. Do you think there's taurine in there? Probably. So when, what's, well, how many days have you both uh, spent on set? Uh, we spent most of the... Uh, three now? For the three? Three days. Probably four for you. Three for me. Yep. All different kinds of locations. Around. There's tractor. <laughs> you know what's raped? funny about it? That, yeah, I'm always getting raped, especially by like uh, homeless people. The other day, as a homeless guy. And now, so it was. They now tractor. They say this story for the people on the DVD. What's? What are, what are you asking me? Which is the same people at home though, but. A story about walking around. Yeah. And going, yeah, we walked around the street. We met a homeless guy, and he said, "Do you want to see my pussy?" And he showed me his tattoo, and it's like a lion licking his tit. You'll see it on Spotlight TV. And then, uh, yeah, he proceeded to bend me over a fucking trash can to help me, and then I, I had to get out of there. He's got a tit piercing, too, like that. No, not piercing, no, just, just a tattoo. Just a pussy. Ah. <laughs> He's got a pussy, too. That's awesome. Everybody's got pussy. Who was that guy? Who was that guy? No. Yeah. Everyone's got a pussy. Yeah, everybody's got a pussy. Too. Well, actually, look. You got a pussy too. The water's going up in it. It's a wet pussy. <laughs> Nigma's got an ass pussy. I have an ass pussy? <laughs> yeah. What's an ass pussy? Here, hold on. <laughs> 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 you already showed you. So uh, how, uh, how long are you spending in our town here in Pennsylvania? I will be here for the full film, I guess, cooking? which is... We started might, on Sunday, start, and Saturday is our last day, so till Saturday. It's time to How did you down. get a, a, a mixed up with Kill Wolf Films? I have to change clothes. <laughs> mixed up. <laughs> uh, I mean, let me let me rephrase that. 
<laughs> How did you get involved with Kill Wolf Films? <laughs> I wrestled for an organization, DCW, and was able to meet Lynn there, and he said they had some available openings for his film that he was working on, so I spoke to him, and that was that. So, like, when did you meet Len? Like, how did you meet Len? Uh, through DCW, he was backstage, and basically, someone had told me he did films, and he said he had an available role, so I spoke with him, and that was about four or five months ago, and that was that, basically. And how about you, Mr. G. Raver? I actually met uh, that one uh, for a uh, wrestling show. Um, he got involved in the match, came in and super kicked me. And after that, we had talked each other for each other for a while, and uh, he offered me to come down and said that uh, through Troy and through himself, and said that he would like me on the uh, set because of just my look and stuff. So it was very cool, and I was very excited to do it and be able to come down here. Did I ever tell you to make my balls itch? No. Okay. That's very special, though. <laughs> yeah, we're here in a junkyard right now in the middle of who knows where. The BFD. We are at here. the corner of Bumfuck and you got a pretty mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so well, what moves did you take and deliver? Missionary. Um, we <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's I think he likes to take a lot of moves. Letting your soul lives here. Your soul lives here on this set right now. Um, uh, we did a few uh, left and right punches and some kicks and stuff between me and Len. Uh, he gave me a throat jab, I backed up, and I ran into a big clothesline. I also did a scene with, I uh, forget her name. Pamela Such. Yeah, yeah, Pamela. And she uh, kicked me in the stomach and then uh, gave me a whip into some of the other survivors. And it was pretty cool so far, and I'm really excited to see how that's going to turn out. Uh -huh. she, she whipped me right in the hem after she kicked me in the gut. The man lies down. Now, how do they do the fight scenes in the movie? Like your fight scenes? Like how long does that take? The process. Um, uh, the process didn't actually take that long, as long as you hit your, you hit the marks pretty well. You know, like if it felt right, and they needed a second, you know, camera shot or second angle for it, it went pretty smoothly. Uh, the only thing I did was uh, the clothesline a couple times, just because we thought we could get a better shot out of it. So we just we did it a few times. So there's a few different shots to have of it. So I'd be excited to see what what they really want to use. I think they're going to use like the last one. Oh, no. <laughs> now how do you do that, like that move, like, 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 because like, you know, like, uh, you, you make it look easy, but now, you know, most normal people couldn't do that, you know? It's, it's a lot easier when somebody actually hits me, like, and that's the thing that I think the movie, <laughs> <laughs> the movie said, <laughs> the movie said tries not to do so much because it's a movie and they're working it, but normally I like a little contact to get hit so I can. Yeah, that tracker, that's an invite there. <laughs> You hear that tractor? That's an invite. I'm not, I'm not a freaking cage fighter. I'm, I'm, I'll just tap out right now. <laughs> How about you? Uh, what moves did I take? Yep. Uh, Pam and such. Gave me a vicious kick to the gut and then threw Mr. G. Raver into me. I attempted to <laughs> harm the main guy with a gun, I guess you could say. <laughs> And he didn't like that much, so he smashed me with a pipe in the face. Uh, how do you do? You die in the movie? Or have you died yet? <laughs> no, so far I haven't really died. Uh, I got smashed in the face with a pipe and kicked. And didn't you take a hard poke to the rear too? <laughs> Wait, say that again. <laughs> Dude, didn't you take a hard poke to the rear? I don't recall that one. <laughs> 